So the organism I chose to talk about are bees. And here are some of the importance of bees. There are more honeybees in the world today than there are any other type of bees. And they are the world's most important pollinators for our food and crops. And it is estimated that one third of our food we consume each day relies on the pollination mainly from bees. Many other things help pollinate our crops and food, but bees is the most important, important one. Pollination happens when a brightly colored flower is moved from one part of the flower to another part of the flower. And the pollination is produced in the male part of the flower, which is called the anther. And then it moves to the female part of the flower, which is called the stigma. And it only takes one tiny piece of tiny grain like piece of pollen to make each food and the fruit or the vegetable. And bees help to pollinate many things like raspberries, blueberries, blackberries, watermelon, almonds, pumpkins, many more things. And also it helps pollinate clover for clover seeds and canola for canola oil. And without pollination, we will have a lot of trouble growing many of our fruits and vegetables today. And if a flower does not get enough pollen or any pollen at all, it would be less it would be would be less crop to the harvest and the fruit would be a lot smaller than it already is. But it is a big problem happening right now. Bees are starting to disappear, die off, and it's starting to put all the other bees under stress. They don't know what's happening with the bees, but they think it might be a disease or some chemical that caught on. They don't really know, but they're trying to figure it out.